I will ruin you. Ellen's cruel bombshell blows Megan to bits with scary revelation selling Montecito home. In the shimmering world of celebrity gossip, few stories capture attention quite like the saga surrounding Meghan Markle and Ellen DeGeneres. The two women, both icons in their own right, have found themselves tangled in a web of intrigue, scandal, and jaw-dropping revelations. Recently, a shocking statement from Ellen DeGeneres has sent ripples through the media landscape, leaving fans and critics alike on the edge of their seats. What is it about Ellen's proclamation that has everyone buzzing? Let's dive in. But before we continue, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. Nestled in the picturesque hills of Montecito, California, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's home represents more than just a residence, it's a symbol of their new life away from the royal spotlight. Purchased for a staggering $14.7 million, the estate boasts stunning ocean views, expansive gardens, and enough space to raise their two children away from prying eyes. However, the tranquility of Montecito has been shaken, thanks to Ellen's recent comments. Ellen DeGeneres, known for her quick wit and playful banter, dropped a bombshell during a recent interview. She claimed that Meghan's decision to sell their Montecito home was not merely a financial move but a desperate attempt to escape a looming threat. I will ruin you, she quipped, leaving everyone wondering what exactly she meant. Was it a joke, or was there a more sinister undertone to her words? This phrase echoed around social media, igniting a frenzy of speculation. What could Ellen possibly know that would lead her to make such a bold statement? Fans began to dissect every word, looking for clues and context, and the media had a field day. To truly understand the implications of Ellen's words, we must first explore the relationship between Meghan and Ellen. From their early friendship, where laughter and camaraderie flourished, to the more recent tensions that have surfaced, their bond has always been a subject of public curiosity. Ellen has been a vocal supporter of Meghan since her days on Suits. Their friendship seemed genuine, with Ellen often praising Meghan for her humanitarian efforts and modern approach to royal duties. But as Meghan and Harry distanced themselves from royal life, the dynamics shifted. Could Ellen's comments signal a rift in their friendship? The media has been relentless in its pursuit of the story. Speculations about Meghan's mental health, her relationship with the royal family, and her place in Hollywood have only intensified. Ellen's statement has added fuel to the fire, prompting tabloids to dig deeper into the lives of both women. Articles with sensational headlines pop up daily, each one more outrageous than the last. Is Meghan running from Ellen's threat, and what does Ellen know about Meghan's future, flood the internet, feeding the insatiable appetite of celebrity watchers. Ellen's words carry weight, and the impact of her statement cannot be overlooked. In a world where social media reigns supreme, a single comment can spiral into a full-blown crisis. The phrase, I will ruin you, is particularly loaded, suggesting betrayal and malice. For Meghan, who has faced a barrage of criticism since stepping back from royal duties, this revelation feels like another layer of scrutiny. It's a reminder that no matter how far she tries to distance herself from her past, the shadows always. As expected, reactions to Ellen's comments have been polarized. Supporters of Meghan have rallied around her, condemning Ellen for her perceived cruelty. How could she say that, fans lamented on social media. Meghan deserves better. Conversely, critics argue that Meghan has brought much of this attention upon herself. They point to her high-profile interviews and public statements as evidence that she has not only embraced the spotlight but also manipulated it to her advantage. In this light, Ellen's remarks could be interpreted as a wake-up call for Meghan to re-evaluate her choices. While the drama between Ellen and Meghan is captivating, it also raises larger questions about friendship, loyalty, and the burdens of fame. In an industry where relationships often feel transactional, how do we navigate the complexities of personal connections? Ellen, a seasoned entertainer, has witnessed the rise and fall of many stars. Her comment could be seen as a reflection of her experiences in Hollywood, where alliances can shift in an instant. The entertainment industry is rife with stories of betrayal, and perhaps Ellen's warning to Meghan was a reflection of that harsh reality. As we reflect on this unfolding drama, there are valuable lessons to glean. 
First, the importance of genuine friendships cannot be overstated. In a world filled with superficial connections, it's crucial to surround ourselves with those who uplift and support us, rather than those who might revel in our misfortunes. Secondly, the media's role in shaping public perception is undeniable. Each headline can influence opinions and dictate narratives, often without context. As consumers of media, we must approach sensational stories with a critical eye, seeking the truth beneath the surface. As the story continues to evolve, one can't help but wonder what lies ahead for Megan and Ellen. Will they mend their friendship, or have the seeds of discord been sown too deeply? In a world where celebrity lives are scrutinized under a microscope, the saga of Meghan Markle and Ellen DeGeneres serves as a reminder of the complexities of human relationships. It's a reminder that behind every headline lies a story filled with emotions, struggles, and the relentless pursuit of happiness. So, as you keep an eye on this unfolding drama, remember to embrace the lessons it offers. After all, in the whirlwind of fame, it's the connections we forge that ultimately define us. Stay tuned, because in the world of celebrity gossip, there's always more to uncover.